This is, this is such a hard video to make because this is such a disgusting, despic, it's not despicable by any means, but, whoo, baby, oh, um, I really wanted to show footage, uh, of this incident, obviously the Andre Gomez incident is such a, a disgusting moment, I think it's, it's definitely the most shocking moment so far of this year's football, uh, because it's, Oh, the ankle break is just, so, it's its diabolical. Son Hyo Min, I know you didn't mean to do it, bro, but my goodness. Um, when you watch it back on VAR, it's its very disgusting. It's very grotesque. It's, it's hard to watch, guys. It's so difficult to watch. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm currently debating right now uh, in this video if I still want to toss it in. Uh, I know obviously people that are going to click on this video, I do apologize if you expected to actually see uh, that, you know, ankle break. I, I can't, I can't do it. I can't, I can't, I can't show it to you. I, I, get well soon, Andre Gomez, get well soon. Uh, because that is, it's so disappointing. I mean, he wasn't having the greatest of years, but Obviously, you know, you're having, uh, you don't want to see someone get their ankle broken uh, so late in the contest as well, in the 80th minute. Everton, I'm glad they came back and drew the contest uh, against Tottenham. I think a draw is deserved after what had happened uh, in this contest. Obviously, there, there was there was a lot of controversy in this game. Davidson Sanchez could have got a penalty. Deli Alley should have had a handball. So VAR not doing his job. Uh, but Sung Hyun Min gets a straight red card. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Sung Hyun Min was destroyed. I I honestly, I guys, I was near tears with him. I I've never seen a grown man uh, so distraught, near tears, nearly crying, uh, all because of of what he did. He knows what he did, uh, and he knows how gruesome it, it will end up looking. And I think Everton fans, I think it was a little hard to see them boo him uh, because I mean the guy didn't mean it. I, he did not mean to do it at all. Uh, like it just it just sucks. It really does suck for him. Uh, I just I got I'm so distraught right now. I'm currently looking at a picture of that ankle break, uh, and it's it's so gruesome. I, I I don't think I've seen an injury this bad. I don't know what else to say about it because I just it's so it, it caught me off guard. It's so like I thought it was just a bad tackle. I thought, I thought it was just a bad tackle in the game. And I really did think uh, that when it happened, I don't think Sun realized how bad it was. I think Andre Gomez immediately realized how bad it was. And the teammates realized how bad it was. Um, and then you you finally, you know, you take the time to witness it. And my goodness, is it hard to watch. Uh, it is. It's, VAR as well, they kept showing replays of it. I don't want to see the replays of his ankle break. I don't want to see it ever again. And... and I, I mean, I'm going to leave this open to interpretation. I don't know if you guys think Sun Hyo Min deserved a red card. Uh, do you think he deserved it? Do you, you know, they just deserve a yellow and just deserve a star? I think a red card is just considering Andre Go I mean, they, we, we had to wait about 10, 15 minutes for Andre Gomez to get off the field. Uh, and it was, it was so difficult to watch. I cannot imagine Everton fans that are there, especially little kids that are there, uh, that have to see this and or witness this uh, because it's hard to look at. But at the same time, um, if you're fans of Sun Hyo Min specifically, I think he took a bit of a hit on the reputation today. I think this ankle, I, I mean, I just, I feel for him. I really do feel for him because obviously he's distraught doing it. Uh, he's, he feels so, so bad in what happened. But at the same time, my guy, uh, that's, it just, it looks like it sucks. It just looked like it. everything involved in the situation, guys, which is absolutely terrible. And I feel so bad, but at the same time, uh, it just, it happens, you know. It really does just happen. But, yeah, obviously you guys got to let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Andre Gomez breaking his ankle in the contest between Everton and Tottenham ends in a 1-1 draw. So Tottenham don't move up the table at all. Everton don't move up the table at all. Uh, but, my goodness. That is not something I, do, I wanted to see. I don't, I don't want to see it again. I, I don't think I can see it again. I can't stomach that. I really cannot stomach that. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I, I, I'm done with this. I, want, I wanted to get to other videos like the Nico Kovac firing or the Mario Bellatelli racism incident. There's been a lot that has happened today. There's been so much that has happened today. Uh, but my goodness, my, this game is just, it's, 
it, it, this football today has just gone on a madness. Okay, so guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and peace.